it frequently seems like an ongoing mental struggle for those involved in a relationship with a narcissistic woman. The psychological wounds may not go away even after the relationship ends. Narcissistic women employ diverse tactics to uphold their authority and sway. With these strategies, the victim's sense of self-worth is meant to be undermined, making them feel unworthy and unattractive. So, here are the narcissistic women's ploy to make you feel unwanted. Number 1. Constant Criticism This insidious ploy serves to maintain the narcissistic woman's sense of superiority and control within the relationship, while systematically eroding her partner's confidence and autonomy. By incessantly criticizing her partner's thoughts, actions, and appearance, the narcissistic woman instills a pervasive sense of inadequacy and self-doubt. Whether it's nitpicking about trivial matters or disparaging their partner's accomplishments, the goal remains the same. To chip away at their self-esteem and assert dominance over their sense of identity. Furthermore, constant criticism serves to create a dependency on the narcissistic woman for validation and approval. As her partner becomes increasingly reliant on her for positive reinforcement, she maintains a position of power and control, dictating their thoughts, behaviors, and self-perception. Moreover, constant criticism is a form of emotional manipulation designed to keep her partner in a state of perpetual insecurity and uncertainty. By fostering an environment where her partner constantly second-guesses themselves, the narcissistic woman effectively undermines their ability to assert their own needs and desires, ensuring her continued dominance within the relationship. Additionally, constant criticism serves to isolate her partner from external sources of support and validation. As their self-esteem diminishes under the weight of her relentless critique, they may withdraw from friends, family, and other relationships, further entrenching their dependence on the narcissistic woman for validation and approval. Number 2. Comparison to others. Comparison to others is a manipulative tactic often employed by narcissistic women to undermine their partner's self-worth and sense of belonging within the relationship. By constantly comparing their partner unfavorably to others, whether it's friends, family members, or past romantic interests, the narcissistic woman seeks to instill feelings of inadequacy and unworthiness. This ploy serves to bolster the narcissistic woman's own ego, while diminishing her partner's confidence and self-esteem. By highlighting perceived shortcomings or flaws in her partner and contrasting them with the supposed superiority of others, she creates a narrative of inadequacy and inferiority, leaving her partner feeling unwanted and unvalued. Furthermore, comparison to others serves to maintain the narcissistic woman's sense of control and dominance within the relationship. By constantly reminding her partner of their perceived shortcomings, she keeps them in a state of insecurity and dependency, ensuring that they remain reliant on her for validation and approval. Moreover, comparison to others can create a toxic atmosphere of competition and resentment within the relationship. As her partner strives to meet impossible standards set by arbitrary comparisons, they may become increasingly isolated and estranged from their own sense of self-worth, leading to feelings of frustration, resentment, and disillusionment. Number 3. Pathological Lying Pathological lying is a nefarious tactic utilized by narcissistic women to undermine their partner's sense of trust, security, and worth within the relationship. By habitually engaging in deceitful behavior and fabricating falsehoods, the narcissistic woman aims to manipulate her partner's perceptions and emotions, ultimately fostering feelings of being unwanted. This insidious ploy serves multiple purposes for the narcissistic woman. Firstly, it allows her to maintain a facade of perfection and superiority, as she crafts elaborate narratives designed to bolster her image and conceal her insecurities or deficiencies. By presenting a false reality to her partner, she cultivates an atmosphere of confusion and doubt, leaving them questioning the authenticity of their interactions and the sincerity of her intentions. Moreover, pathological lying serves to erode the foundation of trust within the relationship, as the narcissistic woman repeatedly betrays her partner's confidence and undermines their ability to rely on her word. This erosion of trust leaves her partner feeling disillusioned and emotionally destabilized as they struggle to reconcile the stark disparity between the truth and the elaborate web of deception woven by the narcissistic woman. Furthermore, pathological lying serves to maintain the narcissistic woman's sense of control and power within the relationship. By manipulating her partner's perceptions and emotions through a web of lies, she effectively asserts dominance and fosters dependency, ensuring that they remain reliant on her for validation, guidance, and emotional support. Number 4. Projecting their flaws onto you. This insidious ploy involves attributing their own negative traits, behaviors, or insecurities onto their partner, thereby creating a distorted narrative where the partner becomes the scapegoat for the narcissistic woman's own inadequacies. 
by projecting their flaws onto their partner, the narcissistic woman effectively absolves herself of any responsibility or accountability for her actions. Instead of confronting their own issues, they shift the focus onto their partner, painting them as the source of dysfunction or dissatisfaction within the relationship. This not only serves to protect their fragile ego, but also allows them to maintain a facade of perfection and superiority. Moreover, projecting their flaws onto their partner serves to undermine the partner's sense of self-worth and confidence. As the narcissistic woman constantly criticizes, blames, or belittles their partner for traits or behaviors that are actually reflective of her own flaws, the partner internalizes these negative messages, leading to feelings of inadequacy, self-doubt, and unworthiness. Furthermore, projecting their flaws onto their partner serves to maintain the narcissistic woman's sense of control and dominance within the relationship. By manipulating their partner's perceptions and emotions, they effectively assert power and foster dependency, ensuring that their partner remains emotionally invested in the relationship, despite the toxicity of their interactions. Number 5. Controlling Behavior This manipulative ploy involves exerting excessive influence over various aspects of their partner's life, including their actions, thoughts, emotions, and interactions with others. By imposing strict rules, demands, or expectations on their partner, the narcissistic woman seeks to establish control and undermine their sense of autonomy and agency. Whether it's dictating how they dress, who they spend time with, or how they express themselves, the narcissistic woman aims to mold their partner into a compliant and submissive individual, thereby reinforcing her superiority and dominance within the relationship. Furthermore, controlling behavior serves to isolate the partner from external sources of support, validation, and perspective. By limiting their interactions with friends, family, or other social connections, the narcissistic woman maintains a position of power and control, leaving her partner feeling emotionally isolated and dependent on her for validation and approval. Moreover, controlling behavior serves to undermine the partner's self-esteem and sense of self-worth. As they are constantly subjected to criticism, manipulation, and coercion, they internalize the message that their thoughts, feelings, and desires are inferior or unworthy. This erosion of self-esteem leaves them feeling unwanted and insignificant, as they struggle to assert their own needs and boundaries within the relationship. Additionally, controlling behavior serves to perpetuate a cycle of manipulation and emotional abuse within the relationship. By exerting control over their partner's actions and emotions, the narcissistic woman effectively undermines their sense of agency and perpetuates feelings of helplessness and powerlessness. Number 6. Threats and Intimidation through the use of threats and intimidation, the narcissistic woman seeks to exert control and maintain dominance within the relationship, often resorting to manipulation and aggression to achieve her desired outcome. By employing threats, such as verbal or emotional abuse, the narcissistic woman aims to intimidate her partner into compliance and submission. These threats may include ultimatums, warnings of punishment, or even direct threats of harm, all designed to coerce the partner into acquiescing to her demands and relinquishing their own autonomy. Intimidation tactics, on the other hand, involve creating an atmosphere of fear and apprehension through verbal or nonverbal means. This can include aggressive body language, menacing stares, or even physical violence, all intended to intimidate and control the partner's behavior and actions. Through the use of threats and intimidation, the narcissistic woman seeks to undermine her partner's sense of security and self-worth, leaving them feeling unwanted and powerless. By instilling fear and uncertainty, she maintains a position of dominance within the relationship, ensuring that her partner remains compliant and submissive to her desires. Furthermore, threats and intimidation serve to isolate the partner from external sources of support and validation, making it more difficult for them to seek help or escape from the toxic relationship. This isolation further reinforces the narcissistic woman's control and power, leaving her partner feeling trapped and emotionally drained. Number 7. Identity Manipulation this deceptive ploy involves subtly or overtly altering their partner's perception of themselves, molding them into a version that aligns with the narcissistic woman's desires and needs. By manipulating their partner's identity, the narcissistic woman aims to assert dominance and reinforce her own sense of superiority within the relationship. She may belittle their partner's interests, ambitions, or values, subtly implying that they are unworthy or inferior. Alternatively, she may project her own insecurities onto her partner, subtly undermining their confidence and self-assurance. This manipulation serves to erode the partner's self-esteem and sense of identity, leaving them feeling unwanted and undeserving of love and acceptance. As they internalize the negative messages and doubts planted by the narcissistic woman, they may begin to question their own worth and validity, ultimately losing touch with their true selves. Moreover, identity manipulation serves to maintain the narcissistic woman's control over the relationship. 
By shaping her partner's identity to suit her own needs and desires, she ensures that they remain compliant and submissive, perpetuating a dynamic of power imbalance and emotional dependency. Furthermore, identity manipulation can lead to feelings of isolation and alienation within the relationship. As the partner's sense of self is gradually eroded by the narcissistic woman's influence, they may feel increasingly disconnected from their own thoughts, feelings, and aspirations, leaving them feeling lost and alone.